How are fans feeling about this deal? Well, if you're taking a look at social media and Twitter, just look at Twitter. Twitter is blowing up with reactions. Look at the Martin Jeff. Be I gone. Know, everybody is dancing. <laughs> Right now, Adam Lago <laughs> continues our team coverage live from Nats Park. And Adam, uh, clearly this is a big deal for D.C. sports fans. Yeah, absolutely. And fortuitously, we find ourselves right smack dab in the middle of what's probably the largest collection of Washington sports fans right now as the Nats game is get to set to get underway here in just a few minutes. I was going to just grab some folks around here, but I'm seeing a lot of New York uniforms, a lot of Mets hats. Listen, just in the past 10 minutes, we've been able to talk to some people who have been coming through to go into the game and ask them what they thought about this. We've had one guy tell us, hey, I didn't want to give any of my money to Dan Snyder, but now that the ownership is changing hands, I might reconsider that. A lot of people seem very pleased at the notion. I'm going to bring in Larry. Larry's all dressed up in the Washington get up, although he did tell me that he's a Cowboys fan. So getting his reaction here is going to be interesting. Larry, the news just breaking within the past couple of hours. The sale is basically pending and official. Dan Snyder will be out as the owner of the Washington Commanders. Your reaction? Well, it really doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because Jack Kent Cook is rolling over in his grave behind all this stuff. All right, that's a long time to be rolling over, yeah. 23 years. Yeah, you know, they haven't won since they left D.C. All right, so what do you make of Snyder, his ownership over the years, and, and how do you feel about it changing hands, even though you're a Cowboys fan? Dick's functional, and they're going to always be, for, okay. my, for my opinion. All right, so your opinion is it doesn't matter who's coming in, the team is not going to do well. They're not going to do well. All right, so we need to actually find a Commanders fan. But, Larry, thank you for your time. I appreciate it. Y'all Commanders fans? No. Are you with them? Steelers fans. All right, we got nobody here. Anybody Washington Commanders fan that wants to come talk to us? We're live on TV. Nobody can be bothered with this right now. But let's go Giants. So we have a large collection of people from outside of the district who are here tonight. But listen, we're going to be around here for the next hour or so. Come back and join us here at 7 o'clock when we can actually assemble some people who are actually from Washington and fans of Washington. I mean, see, these guys right here, they, they got the – you have any reaction – to the Washington Commanders being sold. To who? To who, exactly. See, he's a Mets fan. He doesn't know. These people aren't in the loop. We need to get some people who are in the loop. We'll come back to you when we have those answers. Guys, back what to you. Our oh, hashtag wow. is real matters, <laughs> so <laughs> people did not keep town. it real with you. New York. The game is over. Not, not it's one. Over. We're not, not even one. talking over. about the baseball game. Man. Over. All right. <laughs> okay. Over. We'll go we come back to you, <laughs> We'll see you back here in a bit. <laughs> It's like any Commanders Ooh, that's fans. a rough one. Right uh, that's there. a little tough right there. Who knew that would be tough? <laughs> Got to get an exclusive with the I Commanders fan, right? huh? All right, we're working to learn more about this deal right now. For updates, though, anytime, download our free mobile app, and we will send alerts straight to your phone.